Hello everyone, welcome to our Team Fortress 2 video. So, uh, sorry this is a bit late. I kind of raged a lot when it first came out. I also got up a day before and I stayed up like ages, 20, at least 24 hours for the update and then I was raging because I was really bad. Oh, you have to directly hit with this weapon. So there's contracts and stuff, yeah. Wow, this is a really difficult weapon to use. I don't know how to use this. Wow, this is tough. Can you rocket jump with it, I wonder? I'm not going to risk it because I don't have the health. Actually, hmm. Mission ends in 30 seconds. Can at least try, I suppose. Let's grab this ammo. No, you can't rocket jump, unfortunately. But there is a jetpack added to the game. There's lots of things added, in fact. This thing does not have a lot of range. This is a cool update. I'm just really bad because, as you can see here, I hadn't actually launched TF2 since in September, and I hadn't actually played TF a full game of TF2 since July, I think. And I've really gotten bad at the game, and uh, I raged a lot because, like, I wanted to be good, but I really need to play Team Fortress 2 a lot more. I've gotten so out of so bad at it, really. I don't like this weapon so far. So, uh, it's borrowed weapon. Um, for the contracts you can get, you can borrow it. It certainly requires a lot more skill, I think. use than the regular flamethrower. It's actually quite fun though. It's like a really fast uh, flare gun. I, I thought TF2 was dead before this update, but it wasn't. There was still like 60,000 players per day. So TF2 is not dead. No, it hasn't been dead. If TF2 was dead after Meet Your Match, then TF2 has been dead since the first month. Oh uh, no, the first few months it came out. Because its peak was 117,000. Like a few months after it released. I'm assuming that's when it went free to play, I don't know exactly. This is fun. I would like some health. So it's me, post flame, flame mid editing video. Just wanted to mention that recently Team Fortress 2 passed uh, 100,000 concurrent players, um, which is uh, re which means that Team Fortress 2 is much more than dead. It is revitalized. It is close to being the highest player count it has ever been. Which is pretty cool for this really old game. This map is quite nice. I've played a few of the maps. Um, my favorite so far is Brazil. Oh, not Brazil. Um, Banana Bay. Banana Bay is really cool. It looks beautiful and it's got an interesting concept. Um, they've actually made Payload Race quite fun. Where you have to wait for the, the payload to get crushed by a train. It makes it really intense. I really like it. Hey, we won. I didn't complete my contract, but that's alright. So, I don't know what's happening for Scream Fortress this year, because Scream Fortress is fairly close. Usually it comes out right around now, but I'm assuming they're delaying it because they recently just released this update. So they've also balanced the game quite a bit, which I haven't had much time to play around with the other classes. I've mainly been focusing on Pyro, as most people are, as you can see there. 
I don't know when it will stabilize again. They've added skins to all weapons, which I'm really happy about. I've wanted that for so long. They're both really bad. What happened to that guy? He went flying. Oh, it's blue? No? Oh, he just got the kills. Need this health back. This map seems good. So I don't think I prefer this weapon to the regular flamethrower, but it certainly is a fun alternative. Oh, you have to be really accurate. I'm so used to because it's so close to um, a rocket launcher, I keep trying to do ground damage, but it doesn't work. You need to directly hit the people, which makes sense. Splash damage, not ground damage. What was I saying? Whew, that was stressful. <laughs> Right, we need to get five kills in a single life, which isn't going to be possible here. Why is this guy air blasting? <coughs> Why has he got that on? These questions and more answered in the next episode of Fireball Z. tried. Oh, I can turn this contract in. I want this jetpack. What requirements do I need? Oh, do I have to complete both of these? Okay, oh, I guess I've got to activate this one. I don't know how this gas parser works. I think it's like Jurati, where it's all got an uh, effect that stays in the area. I am so lucky to be alive right now. You are a spy. Hello, spy. How are you, spy? You don't seem that good. I need health. Tad bit confused as to where good health packs are. I know where one is. Ah, here we are. Okay, back over here. Makes sense. Let's go to the control point. Never mind, let's not go to the control point. Let's die. Oh, the gas stays when you die? That's strange. That was a lot of points I just gained. It was a good game. Anyway, I'm really excited that Team Fortress 2 is back. It's been such a long time since Meet Your Match.
Wow, this is what I was expecting um, the Valve map to be. It was sort of this jungly map. He's got the jetpack, I want it. This is awesome. I'm so excited for this weapon. It's not even a weapon, but <laughs> this is the thing I've been most excited for ever since this update was announced. Oh man. I have no idea how to use this weapon. I would like to though, it's pretty awesome. And it looks awesome as well. So, post flames here to wrap up the video. There are five new weapons. The uh, four of them for pyro, one for heavy. I kind of expected that, <laughs> personally. Uh, six new maps. This contract here, which I really like how it works. It does mean though that it's much less luck based and the rewards are purely based on how you perform. And for me that's not good because I don't know if you know this but I'm very lucky when it comes to contracts and particularly in the previous um, Counter-Strike contract I multiplied my money by 10 <laughs> So I'm, I'm a little bit disappointed, on a personal note, um, that it's no longer random, but I think this is a change for the better, honestly. Uh, but as you can see here, the bonuses, you can still activate and you can still do. So I, I like this system. Personally, I would prefer it to be more luck based, but you know, that's for the greater good. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. There will definitely be another Team Fortress 2 video on my channel at some point. I don't have much else to say really. Go play the update yourself. If you want more information on the update, uh, there's a link in the description as well.